Hello everybody. Sorry for the longer than usual please stand by, but I am here. I am the Phenomenal Sir, and I am back with another Sunday night Twitch stream and chill session of The Outer Worlds. Ignore the echo. Hopefully that's our one issue for tonight. And yeah, uh, I looked. It's been like eight days since I played this last. I'm excited to be playing it now, so let's do it. <laughs> <laughs> All right, get the game pad set and ready. I was talking to Divide by Zeros last night, and he informed me that I was never going to beat this game. To which I say, Pa, I am doing it as we speak. All right, get that set up there, and close that. And let's go. I do not even remember what I was doing the last time I played this. I think I might have been on Scylla. I'm not a hundred percent sure. I was oh, I was on Roseway and then the game broke. That's what I was doing. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. Anton's data. I was on Roseway and the game broke. That's right. That's why I did not play it. Alrighty. <clears throat> I've been playing all these, like, pulled back games. Metroid Dread, Bastion. Feels a little weird to be, like, right up in the action like this. <laughs> it's making me a little nervous. I'm sure I'll be okay, though. I am, after all, a supernova warrior extraordinaire. Also, did I... I feel like I oh I hadn't okay so I remember I got I got one of those really good machine guns in here but I haven't got it now so I'll have to just do that oh I was worried I'd do that I was scared of that. I'll do it. No. You're a stalker. You're not a spitter. You're not allowed to do those things to me, sir. Let's see if I can remember how to play. Okay. I got that. I got that one obligatory accidental use of heal out of the way. So we're going to all be gravy from now on. Yeah. Yeah. Hmm. Oh, hey, buddy. Nothing. <laughs> okay. We got a guard and a canid over here. Yep. There's the canid. And there's the guard. Oh, he's... I was going to say he's still alive, but then I'd have made myself a liar, wouldn't I? <laughs> I love this game. This game is so much fun. I can't believe it's been out as long as it has, and I've still never beaten it. I really am ashamed of myself. So down there is where the, um, the Raptodon storage area is. That's the mummy that we don't want to kill. So... Light machine gun mark two. That's not what I want. I want the Spacer's Choice assault rifle, I believe. I believe that's what I'm going for. Hey, you! Over, Over here. here! 
I'm, I'm guessing, guessing you're the one Lillian really described. It's, it's been, been a bit, a bit of a day, so I'll get to the point. point. Yes, yes, I, I have, have brain research. research. No, no, I'm, I'm not, not giving, giving that. that. Sorry, Sorry to disappoint you. you. I suppose, I suppose it does, it does not, not matter. matter. Hello, what you talking about? I have brain sentient, or you are some scavenger come to rob me in my moment of weakness. Let's, Let's make, make a deal. deal. I'd, I'd like, like to go on living. living. You'd, You'd probably, probably like to make some money. money. Help, Help me get, get out, out of here, here and, and I will pay, pay for your trouble. trouble. I just don't like her. I just... <clears throat> they did a really good job with the characters and the motivations and things in this game, because, like, at my core... I'm all about, like, F the corporations. But this woman makes it so hard to want to screw the corporations over because she is so up her own butt. Every word that comes out of her mouth, you can tell she thinks she's just God's gift to the working man. The first thing I need is a key card to unlock my door. Then I need you to clear me a path out. <clears throat> the other way out. All right, I'll help you out. So you lie. We leave. Semantics. You might take it. I'm probably not going to side with her. Hey, buddy. Ow. Just wanted to see if that would do anything. All right. Got a guy in there. Um, bu -bu -bum. Mm, I think we got another one in here, maybe? No? Oh. exactly how badly damaged this is. Oof. Pretty badly damaged. <laughs> There's a workbench in here somewhere, I think. Search that out. previous poorly ending playthrough. We had some goodies in all of here, all of these. And they were free to unlock. So why would we not? Yeah? Hopefully not Supernova Game. Why not Supernova Game? What's wrong, Yelith? You mean, like, hopefully I don't break the game? Also, welcome. How are you today? <laughs> oh. Yeah, it did break last time. That's true. Um, I'm doing good. Um, Calrea left me all alone here tonight so she could go get her car inspected. Um, and she's spending the night at her parents' house, and then they're going to get it inspected up there. That's good. We uh, we got up. We got up. Well, it was normal time for me. It was early for her, and um, we did some we did some cleaning around the house, and then we we spent a few hours playing Stardew Valley on our on our private farm and then um, I just kind of hung out for a bit till it was time to stream 
Not really a whole lot else to say. I'm off tomorrow, so I might do a little impromptu stream, but no promises. I don't know. I'm torn between streaming something and um, working on Voltage. So maybe I'll stream myself working on Voltage so Denaz can play it finally. I know I keep telling him soon, soon, and then I don't even look at it for days and days. <clears throat> I think he's building it up in his brain as something better than it's going to be. <laughs> it the only thing is it'll be it'll be interesting because you guys are going to mostly see me just jumping around if i do that it would be mostly me jumping around in rpg maker so it might be educational in a way for people but um you won't be able to see a lot of play testing like it'll be like 10 minutes of work and then i'll test some dialogue and there's, I'm not doing anything really crazy in it, so I don't know how much enter, entertainment value it would actually have. I'm not going to be, like, programming any really intricate events or cinematics or anything. It's just going to be, like, finishing up some quests, putting in items and, and some dialogue, that kind of thing. Early on, I kept threatening to, to stream myself learning how to program in Unreal Engine, and I never did that either. I'm more apt to do that sort of thing when I have two monitors, when I finally get my second monitor hooked up. <clears throat> ah. Every time I start this game up, I'm reminded of how I screwed myself by, by recruiting those people when I had no intention of putting them in my active party. Yeah. My desk is not huge, is the thing. I, the, my, I've got like a little sort of a mini L-shaped desk, um, but I've got a lot of stuff on my desk, so I I might be better off getting a bigger monitor, like getting one of those fancy curved monitors or something, and then just putting two windows side by side on it. I don't know. Because I think two, I've got, I think this is a like a 22 or a 24 inch monitor, something like that. And it would be a pretty tight fit to put a second one of these on my desk. <laughs> oh, give me that. Give me that. No, 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 no. Okay. Well, I got the I got the Mark II assault rifle that I wanted at least. So there's that. Um, Anton's office. We already know his notes are gone. See, there they are. Or there they aren't. Sorry. But, but we'll see. Maybe I'll, yeah, my, my L shape though, most of, I think I've shown this before, but most of the L shape is just my, my tower. And then like, this is where I put my mini systems and things when I've got them hooked up for streaming. So there's not a whole lot of space. <laughs> I don't know how well you could see that because I don't have it pulled up on my screen to see what I was showing you, but you get the idea. We'll see. But yeah. Right. I have I have carpeting in here and cats, and I could see putting it on on a little tower like that, and then the cats knocking it down, and then me not having cats anymore because I killed them all. So I can't do that, unfortunately. I would just start swinging wildly into the pack. Just whoever got hit would get hit. a way to like mark stuff in this game there's there's some stuff you can do in this that i just don't know how to do on the xbox controller like you can mark things as trash so that it automatically sells 
or put certain things in the junk bin. I need to look that up. Like, there's a way you can set it up so, like, every time you get a mock apple, it's automatically put in the, the cell, cell pile. So you just go here and sell everything instead of having to go through all your different um, inventory things. Oh, look at it. 576 versus 262. There we go. Now, as I recall, I either have bought or found a another corrosive mod, and that's what I had put on the gun before. But hmm. we'll have to see. Yeah. <sighs> end up having to take the glass off the side of my tower again so it doesn't blow up playing this extremely extremely difficult to run game from several years ago that's cool that's cool were you using like an actual SNES or were you using were you using like a ROM or an emulator or what like how are, what was what's your setup going to be you don't need a supernova? No, I don't need a supernova computer also. All right, that's our three sedative dealies. An actual, okay. Cool, cool. I don't know if this sort of thing interests you. I know we had talked before and you were playing a little bit of, you were playing a little bit of Mega Man the other day, but I, ha I couldn't help but notice on Steam that our our boy Denazatello has purchased the Mega Man Legacy Collections one and two, so you know he's gonna be he's gonna be after us for some hot Mega Man action soon. And you're definitely better at Mega Man than I am. You made it through like most of the first half of the game without actually dying at all. Made me feel like an inadequate gamer. Apparently, I'm thirsty. There we go. There we go. Just eat some raw lizard meat. Quite the same as the classic ones. That's right. This is back from before before robots had kneecaps, right? Couldn't couldn't slide until Mega Man 3. No crouching. Hey, divide by zeros. How are you doing, buddy? <clears throat> oh. Did I get the stuff I need for that? Three of 12 Raptodons killed. Hmm. Hmm. Good. Good, good, good. 
We were just talking about Mega Man. And the need to play it. Right in the noggin. scary. Hmm. Hmm. I don't know. I was really torn. I was I was thinking about playing more Metroid Dread because I left right at, I, I finished up last night right at the next boss fight, but then I heard Divide by Zero's voice in my head saying, you will never finish the Outer Worlds. Ever finish the outer worlds. And I knew what I had to do. I had to finish the outer worlds. I had no choice. Oh. finishing the Outer Worlds. Well, it's not going to happen tonight. I need to finish the Outer Worlds. I bought the game twice, and I have all the DLC on two different systems. Because I got the damn pass on the PS4, and now I'm playing it on the, on Steam. I paid too much money not to beat this game. <laughs> I have a problem. I need Yellif to hurry up and hurry up and go partner so he can he can bring me on his stream team and then I can quit my job too. He can drag me upwards to the to the land of success. Pretty sure I have a security key card. Pretty sure I literally used one in the security dude's office. Raptodons, Raptodons, security. You never know, man. You never know. have acid for me? No, of course not. Of course not. Better than nature. And that's the exit. nature. And bop, bop. Okay. Divide by Zeros called me yesterday and he was telling me how much he's looking forward to the Halloween stream at the end of the month. I'm going, damn dude, it's three weeks away. Oh, don't remind me. Okay, so I guess I could do some fancy footwork in here.
Well, we're definitely going to get to do some indie games. Because we're well over the two hour marks. And sneaky, sneaky. Oh, you don't see me. No, no, no. I'll just let them chill out for a little bit. I can't believe I actually snuck in there and, and did that. Normally they spot me right away. Interesting. Hmm. So I need to find Dude Man's um, office and get a key card made. Which I guess is in here. Let's see. Ow. It's a good month. Not a whole lot to hate about October. Calrea was talking to me today about how we should see about getting a couple of trees taken out of our yard before before winter because there's one that the, the branches are like hanging out over the house and I'm going, oh God. But, but my bonus, I want to spend it on fun stuff. And she was like, having a roof on our house is fun. And I said, yeah, that's true. And I had to be responsible. Damn it. Oh, see, so I came in here. I just didn't go into that room because I assumed it was a prison cell. Psh. I don't know what the joy of it is. <clears throat> but we've got a tree over our over our detached garage that it it drips on the roof of the garage and it there's like a, a garage and then a carport next to it and you can see two specific spots on the carport where it's like bowed in and it collects water and underneath it's starting to go bad so we want to replace the roof on that but there's no sense in replacing it before we get rid of the branch that's causing it to get all rotted out so we got it so we're like well we might as well take out that tree and we're talking about putting in a patio but to put in the patio it's going to block off part of the yard so they won't be able to bring machinery in after the patio is done so we got to do that and And one of the trees is on the other side of the septic field, so they're going to have to come in and do that one. They're going to have to go up in the tree and just cut it apart. They're not going to be able to bring machinery in that part of the yard. There's no way. So. Um. It's for all full-time state employees, Divide. As long as you were a full-time employee by, by on November 10th, um, everybody gets it. All the non, well, all the like administrative people get it for my, for my agency. The security people get something else. They get more. Um, but it's split up into two payments for them. <clears throat> but... My plan was to just pay off, pay off, pay off all my credit cards, and then have some for Christmas. But I don't want her to have to pay to have the trees taken out just because she's more fiscally responsible. Yeah, it's the only raises I've gotten in the seven and a half years I've been there. Yelleth is when they give everybody a raise, and it's like one percent or something crazy. Um, yeah, look at ask about it. Divide. It's it's. It's, uh, I don't know. I thought it was for all state agencies, but maybe it's just for my agency and I'm just, I'm just selling you a line. In which case, I'm sorry. I am doing it because I can. Because it thrills me. Oh, okay. Well, if you're just here for fun. Here, I thought you were worried about protecting the little guy. Man, that was fun. Yeah, she's she's terrible. That character. Oh, 
it, 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 it gives me it gives me a thrill to, to murder scientists. Hmm. Hmm. Let's just remember, everybody, I am playing a character that acts mostly on gut instinct, so don't judge me. We all knew what this was when I came in. <laughs> I said all along I'm not going to think too hard before I do stuff in this game. There's a whole lot of like mint stuff in here. What a fancy hat. Mm. Mm. Y'all heard him. He just gave me laissez faire to just go buck wild. Whatever. Your TV is like as big as my first bed, Divide. <laughs> He's got a very nice TV. One percenter TV. He's like, what? <laughs> Maybe. He's typing furiously right now. That's what I hear. gas-induced brain damage. Ah! Got it. So where's the security guys at? I hate the layout of this base. It's very silly. It's very confusing. I do not like it. I just keep running through the same little loop de loop area with no freaking clue where I'm supposed to be. Oh, danger sign. Nice. Nice little decoration. Hmm. It's true, he's a movie fan. A cinephile, as they say. It's, maybe we maybe we shut the door, just for safety. 
All right, security guys, where are you? You're supposed to be securing the place. I'm about to just leave and find the front door and go in that way. See if maybe that'll help me. Need to try shutter. I've got it. If you want to look at it, my my thing, we we just never watch TV in general. Oh. <laughs> Oh, <laughs> she she had she was aggressive. Um, it's only like three or four bucks a month, so if you can get one good movie a month out of it, I feel like it pays for it, honestly. Um, because a lot of those streaming sir, it doesn't have a huge selection, but they're constantly changing it, and they've got a lot of like unique stuff, and. You know, it's a third of the price of, like, Netflix or whatever, so I like it. Better than nature. There we go. So that's the side entrance. Yeah. I honestly, I still think that the, my favorite thing I've seen on Shudder has to be One Cut of the Dead. I freaking love One Cut of the Dead. That movie is so funny. And it's so good. Like, in the worst possible way. It was one of those, the first time I watched it, I watched it with Calrea. And the only reason I didn't cut it off after 20 minutes is because, as a rule, I almost never stop a movie. Like, I've only ever walked out of one movie, ever, in the theaters. And I will almost always keep the movie running. Even if it doesn't entertain me, I'll keep it running because you never know when something interesting might happen. Um, it's got to be something really, like, off. For me to for me to turn it for to, for me to turn it off, there's only one horror movie I've ever turned off, and I can't remember what it is, but it it was supposed to be like a like a you know guy dressed up as a clown killing people on Halloween kind of thing, but like the third person that died in that film was the most ridiculously over the top like torture porn level killing that I was just like nope. This is not the movie I want to watch. Like, I'm not into that type of stuff. Like, I'll watch I'll watch a scary movie with a murderer every once in a while, but I'm not into like saw type stuff. Like, I don't I don't derive pleasure from watching other people go through stuff. Um, I like the jump scares and the, the thriller type stuff, and and I like found footage movies and things like that. I don't know. It was one where it was one where somebody got got cut vertically. That's as that's as into it as I'm gonna get. It's, it might have been Terrifier. I think the first person that died got turned into a jack o' lantern in that film, and then it it went downhill very quickly from there. <clears throat> and I was I was not about that. Yeah. You done a job over. After you attacked their employer, the gun hand started surrendering. Or try to slip out. I'm having a hell of a time keeping my people from shooting. I reckon there's plenty enough blame to spread it around some. Lost some of my own in the fight. Sign at my door says it is. But I didn't. Get down to Rose. Hmm. Okay. Is this stealing? It's not stealing, it's looting. There's a difference. <coughs> T 
Terrifier sounds familiar. The, the name sounds familiar. I think that's what it was. But I really but anyway, I really liked one cut of the dead. Best best found footage film I think I've ever seen. And you know, found footage movies, they always have a bit of a corny spin to them. Um was Greystone Park and it was like your standard college kids go in, they want to make a movie, they go into the haunted asylum and then, you know, they all get picked off type thing. But the thing I liked best about that movie, other than the the fact that there was basically no production value to it, so it made it look more realistic because they were actually just using, like, poor lighting and, and jiggly cameras and stuff, um, was the fact that there was a lot of stuff in that movie that the characters didn't see, if that makes sense. Like, when you're watching a found footage film... And they're constantly like, oh, what was that? And you didn't hear anything. They do the same thing in the Ghost Hunter movie, the Ghost Hunter TV shows and things, right? Where they're like, did you hear that? And you're like, no, there was clearly no sound. But they went in the complete opposite direction with Greystone. And there was a lot of stuff that when you're watching it, you see that they didn't see because they were too busy having a conversation and somebody just like walks by in the background or whatever. Which is way scarier when you when they don't see the, the creepy thing that's in there with them than when they're reacting to stuff that's not there. So I really liked that one. <clears throat> we need to do a Halloween. I know we keep saying we, we I know we keep saying we need to do some movies divide. Um, I'm gonna talk to Calrea if you're interested about possibly doing like some some horror movies or something next weekend if you want to maybe see with the boss about coming over if she'd be into that um nothing nothing super crazy but like i was thinking like some some more classic -y stuff like tremors and things like that and i feel old to call tremors a classic but it's a classic come on man the original tremors young kevin bacon good stuff but we could watch a handful of handful of films. <clears throat> Trick or treat? I think so. Is that is that an anthology one where where like it turns out that the bad that the ghost or whatever is like some some evil demon that's basically punishing people for not for not celebrating Halloween correctly or something like that? I think I've seen that one. I know I've talked with somebody about it before if I haven't seen it. But yeah, we could we could go through like the stuff on Shutter and see if we could find something. Um, I've got a good good collection of films that Cal Ray has never seen even. Um, we got through, we, we were going to, we claimed we were going to do one movie for every day in October last year, and even with COVID being a thing, we only got through about 18 or 20 films, so, over the course of the whole month, but, she'd be good for two or three, I think. Yelith, you're invited too, but you gotta, you gotta get your own ticket out here, man. <laughs> honestly yeah we watch we watch twitch and we watch youtube videos and that's pretty much it <laughs> and she gets offended if i watch anything without her even if i'm watching tv and it's something she doesn't want to watch she gets pissed if i'm just watching anything in general without her so like nights like tonight when i'm done streaming i'll probably stay up and watch a movie or something just because she's not here to to be angry at me for watching stuff without her. Don't tell her anyone. Keep it a secret. Um. Before we start turning in quests, let's let's go back to our ship. 
and save. We've been playing for 45 minutes and we haven't saved. I got the hiccups. Oh god. <gasps> Okay, and transfer. I always want to save all the special weapons, and then I don't ever do anything with them. I don't think I've ever had a build that actually utilized a specialty weapon. This is the one that's broken. I need to replace them. Yeah, okay. That's me. Nice try. I'm on the second floor. There you go. <laughs> normally it doesn't... Normally the problem with that one is it won't roll up and down. You have to actually take it down and do that. Maybe there is a ghost in the house. Because that one, the one on the left has been, has been fucked up for like, since we moved in, it won't, uh, yeah, I know. Sure. Oh. Well. Make it too spooky. Not till the end of the month. We've hit we've hit the first goal. If we get if we get a total of 20 new followers, the next the next goal is uh the next goal is um turning off the lights during the spoopy stream. It's time. I can tell I don't think he's doing it, but I can tell you a Catholic Bible in 10 minutes. The ghost gets you. That's true. I was gonna say. I swear to God, if 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 uh, divide by zeros is like outside my house watching me on his phone and he starts he starts messing with me, it y'all are gonna see a, a real live murder on <laughs> on on Twitch. I'm definitely getting banned because I'm killing somebody. <laughs> Now I gotta make sure he's not, because he would do that shit too. He only lives ten minutes away. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Divide by zero is only only lives about six miles from here. So. <laughs> hmm. Crit damage. Mm. We'll keep that for now. You live in my walls, like like the boy. <laughs> That's the stupidest movie ever. I'm talking about talking about stupid, scary movies. That movie, The Boy, where it was like a doll, a crawl space below my bed. Okay. <laughs> Lord. Hmm. 
There we go. That's what I was doing before I got distracted. By divide by zeros is not nice lies. Oh, Vortex Mace. Oh. That's really cool, except the fact that it's like half the strength of my weapon. Well. The funny thing, the funny thing with crawl spaces and things in the walls and stuff. Calrea was terrified because she kept waking up thinking there was somebody moving around in the attic and it's because we got a walnut tree behind our butt on the corner of the house by the dining room and it keeps dropping these huge nuts on the roof and it sounds like they hit the roof and they go plunk, brrr, and it sounds like somebody running back and forth through the attic. <laughs> And she was she was freaking out about it. I told her as long as they stay up there, I don't give a shit. Don't don't come down here. You stay up there, do whatever you want. Just don't don't come down here, and we'll be fine. <laughs> that's Carl. That's like in The Simpsons, right? That's that's where they they put the bad twin, but then he's got the scar on the wrong side, and it turns out he was the good twin all along. That's Carl. I don't know if I want you coming over to my house anymore, Divide. You're trying really hard to be mean to me, and it's not Halloween yet. Is my ship on fire? Is this... This doesn't seem like the sort of thing that's supposed to happen in a spaceship, right? Like... Felix, why you got such gray hair, bro? Okay. Meat. 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 Yeah, that... Mm. Pure comfort food this time of year. Purpleberry lunch! A one kilogram bag full of ears of tobacco horn. It's a meat. Tobacco corn hybrid that's classified as meat. Only in the outer worlds. Borst and baked beans. I love it. It's the worst. It's not the worst unless it's forced worst. worth upgrading weapons, is it? Okay. I guess we'll go on back. <clears throat> the sir. I want to get I want to get a nice fancy expensive um, barrel and scope mod for that machine gun. Yeah. I don't know. <laughs> I'm not saying it's not spooky and all divide, but the whole like, there's a face behind you, you know, there's a person outside your third story window, like as scary as that is, there's kind of a fatalistic aspect to it because it's like, well, 
I'm alone in the house, so if there's the the spirit of a of a demonic nun here and it's it's coming for me, then I'm done. Like <laughs> it's it's out of my hands now, you know. It's just like all right, well, uh, at least hopefully I get some follows out of this if I'm gonna die. <laughs> <clears throat> You'd love to be a ghost. I talk to Calrea all the time about like different, like what they need to do with these ghost chaser movies and things like that. I'm like, you know what I want? I want a part. I want one where they come in and they're like, there's, there's a spirit here and it's angry. And you just hear the voice be like, you're goddamn right I'm angry. And a whole table just flips across the room. Like, I want a ratchet ghost, you know? Just once. I want I want one of these movies to have the ghost just be completely off the chain. It's not like, not like oh my god, that pen moved while I was looking at it. I want, I want the ghost to be like, get the hell out! <laughs> just flipping chairs and throwing stuff. That, that I would watch. I would watch that. <clears throat> oh. Pow. Where'd your friend go? Oh. Oh, I missed. How am I so bad at games? Holter guy game, maybe some of those ghost hunting games. Ah, oh, like Phasmophobia and stuff like that. Yeah. You'll have to remind me next time you come over. I got a. I have a great idea for a um, a TV series that's based off of like those ghost hunter, the ghosts of Morgantown, and all of those. Um, it's, it's too long to explain right now without me losing track of my thoughts because I, I have a good idea of how I am. Um, but next time you're over, you need to remind me, Divide, and I'll, I'll tell you all about it. You'll like it. This is true. Well, it's a it's a good thing he doesn't have a spare key then. I don't think. No, you're not. I can see you're not. <laughs> If you come over, that means you got to be on the stream. I'm honestly speaking of speaking of phasmophobia, though. I am still flabbergasted that I couldn't get Mommy Dommy and Cal Rea to play that game with me. As much as they're into that stuff, I would have thought that they would have eaten that game up. Like that, I just stole stuff. Nobody saw me. The perfect crime. I'm sorry, officer. I didn't know it was stealing. I literally took the helmet off a dead body in the street and no one cared. These coffins? Oh, it's a letter. Okay. Hey, buddy. You've returned. What, what news? news? Please, Please tell, tell me. me. You've Not just any teeth paste, the ultimate teeth paste. Maybe they had a nasty fall. Not to mention an easy weight loss on fewer calories. If 
My reason? That's it. You can't pass it. And one paper. Capital. Excellent. Actually, there is something else. Um, why do you suppose Auntie Cleary would want to mark a dialogue in place for the lower class? I haven't seen many fat townspeople now that you mention it. Yes, but that doesn't quite mean true. There's something in this here. It nags at me like a sword. But, but... But look, this could be a disaster. Why did I not realize that? Because you're dumb. I would love to argue with you. All I cared about before was my son. Yes. yes. Did we did we actually just like help him find his conscience? That underhand I suppose. I suppose. Uh oh, I didn't want to do that. I just wanted to tattle on him. I wanted to keep the musk. Damn it. Well, failed that quest. Well, I guess I succeeded on it in that I finished it, but... Oh. Buddy! Vaughn, I accidentally told on you to your boss. I'm sorry. So, my question is, is that random treasure, or is there a reason that Anton Crane has a dissident helmet in his locker? Hmm. Interesting. Nothing. It's better than nature. Told you. Um, modify exacto sight. Puts me puts me on the big TV. Oh, I'm moving up in the world. Finally on a big screen. What's that? What's that song? Hey, look, Ma, I made it. <laughs> right? <laughs> hey, Vaughn. Any news? Any news? Don't, Don't keep me in suspense. Did you get, did you get... What? what? Shit. Shit! Do you have any, any idea how much trouble, trouble I... Why would you, Why would do, you do that? that? I'm sorry. Seems like the right idea at the time. Damn it! Damn it. I gotta get it again before he. Before he... Yeah, bye. yeah, bye. So my reputation went up with Auntie Cleo for telling on him, but then it went down because I told him I told on him. Seems legit. 
Oh, I'm sorry. Yeah, my my work, we have to listen to a lot of like audio tapes and things, and we're supposed to use headsets, and I don't because I have the same issue. Like after eight or ten hours of wearing headphones a day, it it doesn't work for me, and the earbuds are even worse. The earbuds just make my ear hurt. Oh, look, look at the skybox. Divide, look at the beautiful skybox just for you. The rings are touching the volcano. You know how, how hype I would be if I saw that thing go I would be unreasonably excited if that <laughs> if I actually thought that I had hit that. Okay. Well, I've spent all the money I've been earning on um, weapon upgrades, so unfortunately I don't have the money. <sighs> Sorry, guys. Not me. I want to go to Scylla real quick. I want to check. I want to check those um, vending machines right by the entrance to Scylla, and see if I can get a barrel mod that I like for this gun. And then I think. If I don't have the money to, to finish either version of the quest, I think I might just go through Cascadia. I think I might be strong enough now. Oh, another beautiful, terrifying skybox. Oh, I disagree. sleepy and thirsty. Oh no. Look at him up there just wishing he was as good a shot as me. Boom. Try out this fancy gun. Oh, my ankles! Oh. Hey, buddy. Oh, holy. <laughs> okay. Buddy, you okay? Love it. Do you, you know there's actually an achievement specifically for showing a set number of enemies mercy in the yelleth way. Um, if you slow down time and then and then show them mercy enough, you actually get an achievement in this game, yelleth. And they do react to it, as you would expect. Oh, 
It's if they don't die instantly. Well, he died. But yeah, they actually, they react in the expected manner um, if they survive the first hit. Half these guys aren't even giving me loot because I'm too strong for them right now. Someday that's all about mercy. Amen. Nutcracker the Powerful. Hey, you jerk. Used more ammo than I wanted to on that fight. I'm blaming holes. The Hazard, not the movie starring Shia LaBeouf. And also, inability to stream at optimal viewing times. That's what I'm blaming. here pretty sure I cannot no I don't think I can get up on that one low pressure hell. okay well the reason I came here was not to kill enemies in humorous ways but to check the vending machines so let's check the vending machines and then I'll take a nappy nap. Always good to find some things to blame. This is a good weapon and mod combo. I'm, I'm, I'm happy with this. This pleases me. Oh, we can kill that mega that, or the, yeah, the mega that I saw before and I wasn't ready for. Got, I think he got zapped back. I think I've got that reactive plating stuff. Ooh. Lots of goodies. Okay. Occasionally there's a named there's a named primal over here. That's kind of tough too. He's like Colonel something or other, and he's a, he's a smaller one. He's not a giant one like that, but he hasn't popped up. So hmm. hmm.
Okay. Ooh. Bye, have a beautiful time. Okay. Always good to find some things to blame. True, true, true. Um, mag to zap, padded. No, 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 no. Whisper quiet muzzler. Um, no. No. And then there's one over here too, right? Oh, another corrosion one. Interesting. Probably shouldn't spend that money, though. That's CNP. So, Yelith, are you going to be streaming tomorrow? I have trouble remembering your schedule. I'm sorry. If I asked you that already, I'm also sorry. I need me some pro mode Ninja Gaiden in my life. Otherwise, I might have to play it, and nobody wants to see that. Let's go to Phineas's lab and steal his science weapon real quick because that's a quest for whatever reason. Um, and I think that's the last science we weapon. So. Bow. And there we go. Negotiate with Sprats for territory. Oh, we're thirsty, hungry, and sleepy. Well, that's no good. Oh, and I'm scared of falling, apparently. Hey, buddy. I have no I have no desire to end up like Thompson. You sent me there, bro. And you specifically gave me a speech about how they were all just cogs in the corporate machine without souls or conscience. At least in my in my head cannon he told me that. And then I used my hand cannon to act on it, so you know, who's really the bad guy here, me or him? Um, groundbreaker. The groundbreaker has approved your request for docking, Captain. You're free to disembark. I'm gonna be famished by the time I wake up. Okay. And. Oh, no, it's not filling at all. It's just another corporate trick. Oh, damn it. Okay. A little bit of lag. Nothing to be afraid of. 
I almost, almost ran face first into that. Don't worry about it. It's all part of the show. Ranged weapon spread and sway down. I feel like that would be better for like a sniper rifle. I don't know. Rest and go. Chickadee! Have you had a moment? moment? You don't know. So about that offer from before. What? What? What'd you turn, What'd you turn up? up? Well, that's mm -hmm. just just well, well sweetheart. sweetheart. Good for, Good for you. you. Mm. A shame you, you didn't, didn't visit old Gladys, Gladys first. first. That would have fetched a good price. price. I may have I may thrown in a patch of my favorite sugar, sugar cookies just to sweeten the deal. deal. If Auntie Auntie Cleo's, Cleo's exporting wraps from Monarch, 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 Monarch,
Do you have, you have it? it? You know, you know my good Oh, my, my lord. You, you, now then, now then. I just I have, have to open the seal here. here. Sign like, like so. so. Ta-da! Ta <laughs> here are the here forms you need once you reach Byzantium. Oh, oh, and in that key, so you should travel there. Those authorization forms will let you speak with Sophia when you arrive. I'll send her a message straight away to let her know you're coming. Like it, I'm sure. Miss Akande, the chairman's right hand. She practically runs the colony on her own. She can fill you in on all of them. Are we going then? Da 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 da! And just like that, we got better. Um. And. Perks. I, th I feel like we might want to start working on the science perks. Maybe. Plus 50% science weapon damage. Um, and then we'll have another one there. Yeah. There we go. Noise. Anything else? Oh, I gotta do this one too. Udom, my brother. Can you help me out, please? How do you do? About Jesse Dorn. That's. What guarantee do I have that you might be? I will recall. Now, now. Bye. Boom. The good news. Tell you what. I'm a little short. If you're looking. If I'm being. But we can. You got work from Udon from the hitman who trailed me the other night. I ain't too elated about going. You sure saved my skin. There we go. So Ellie is now recruited. And that's another quest done. Weapons from the Void. We haven't been to Fallbrook yet. Salvager in the Sky. We could talk to Lilia while we're here. She might give us some jobs while we're on Monarch. Truth. Welcome, Welcome to Sub. Do the one. one. Miss Lily is. Hey, hey, Doc Fan Hill. Glad to that. Hey, Tobias. Good, Good as you left, left man. man. Still, Still bending bend everything. Bend everything. Took some extra lead while I was on it. The other, other guy thought his ship was perfectly operational. operational. I told I him it was salvage. Workplace has happened. Sure am. These days. Alrighty. Hey, girl. So you're, so you're the new captain, captain in town. I was hoping you know, I will say, one of my complaints, this game looks really nice, but everybody has the exact same eyes. I don't know if you guys have noticed that, but almost every character has the same green eyes with, like, the brown ring in the middle. And that's just unusual because green eyes are not that common. And I can't imagine that they selected for green eyes when they were picking colonists to come out here. Not a word. Kidding. It's, it's nice, nice to see to the unreliable. unreliable. Is Ada, Ada still, still at the helm? I don't know I don't how, know how many times I told Hawkeye to restore that smart, smart ass to back back seven. I have, I a, have salvage a salvage job, job for someone, someone like me. Like. Would it be my job? If you if have, you a, have nap, a nap, you I like that initiative. But there's any. 
Oh well, I don't have a I don't have a nav key to Stellar Bay because I'm not a sucker that's going to pay ten thousand dollars for access to a town I can walk to. Sorry, looks like you're not in the market for original thinkers like me. <laughs> this isn't going to work out. quickly get Ellie out of the party so that my stats will all jump up. But not as much as if I hadn't recruited any of these losers. Oh. Oh. Poorly optimized gameplay. Wait a second. I need to get something with heavy ammo usage. Um, so now we can just we can just go to Byzantium. That's amazing. Okay. Um Let's do it. Okay. I never did this before. I, I mean, I never, I've never beaten the game, but I also like barely made it to Byzantium, and I had never been to Byzantium this way. Like, I was always loyal to, I was loyal to Phineas before. So, oh, this gun! Oh my God! Look at the. This gun is amazing. Oh, oh my, it's beautiful, it's so beautiful, I may cry, I would end up in a civilized town immediately after getting this weapon. This is not the landing pad I'm familiar with from before. So I actually did get a nice private landing pad. Nice. Private. Cool. Feels like a waste of space. What do they got? I gotta see what they got. Oh god. <sighs> gotta check the vending machines. Oh. Nah, that's nothing good. Okay, whatever. I thought that was a jack-o'-lantern for a second. That's interesting. It looks like it looks like a head and then like a body and then a cloak. Cool. Like it. Love it. Percival Platt. I see, I see you have been shot to pieces, pieces by the, by the guards. guards. Of course. Of course. You're that You're curious, curious spacer, spacer miss, miss, Madam Madison. Bedford's Bedford. Bedford. No, thank no, you, Percival. Percival. I doubt this will take long. 
I'm Sophia Akande, adjutant, adjutant to the chair. Wakanda forever. The sir. I've been I'm reading all about, about you. This dossier from, from Emerald Vale was especially, especially engrossing. Yep. You have a file. I have a file on everyone. I have a file on Percival here. here. You wouldn't you believe, believe what he gets up to during private hours. hours. Oh, I would. I've been I've keeping been up with you ever since Emerald Vale. Vale. Now that was an interesting piece of work. work. A rundown run back, back, barely worth the ink on a map. Until you showed up. When you cut off power to Edge War, you saved me a great deal of trouble. Now I don't have to bother trying to save that town. Anyone with eyes can see that you're talented. But you're also unpredictable. That's true. I don't like unpredictable. Okay. That's just the price of working with me. But as an investor, you're also a risk. I'd like to take you for a try run. Okay. I have a job for you. Rachel Lockwood, cartographer for the Bureau of Exploration. She's done some sensitive work for us. Lockwood has to go. Get rid of her. I'll tell him. It isn't as if we executed Lockwood for mislabeling a river. The nature of Lockwood's work was sensitive, confidential, and concerns the future. The board has a lot of prop. I'm the chairman's adjutant, not his sycophant. I can't get what health young needs is people of integrity. Deal with Lockwood, and I'll know that I can. Consider it done. At the very least, I expect you to do better than the other three. We've hired outside contractors before. Dependable and competent. I'll tell you. Hmm. Let's not mince words. I know you're eager to do. Excellent. Free level up. I like it. I like it. I like it. Um. Just onward and upward, I suppose. Boom, boom, boom. Hey, Percival. Apologies for the wait. Personal, Personal assistant, assistant adjutant Akane, and, and chairman. chairman. Quite, Quite so. so. I, owe I owe the honor, the honor of my, my current, current position, position to a reputation. Will there, Will there be? Well, he was supposed to give me papers, and I did not get papers. But. Okay. Didn't give me a lot to go on with this quest. But I do have this amazing gun that does 1,000 DPS. So I'm sure I can figure it out. Oh, she's like legit just downstairs. Holy shit. Okay. Whee! Oh, no, she's not. She's in a different building. At least she's in a different building. I was like... It's like, damn, they literally just want me to go downstairs and cap this woman and then come back upstairs. This is madness. Okay. This is actually ugly. I don't like this. Of course, the Rockwells have a street named after them. <laughs> Transition to Bureau of Exploration. Welcome. Welcome, Welcome to the Byzantium office of, I mean, I mean Bureau, 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 Bureau of Exploration. Of exploration. I'm, I'm, never mind who I am. Hi there. there. Well, hey there. Well, hey there. Okay. Okay. Damn, Damn, fine, fine. you got, got me. I ain't a receptionist. Truth be told, I'm going to know. Lying to a stranger weighs heavily on my spirit. I was, I was hired, hired to cross off this lock. I'll just I'll tell just her tell I'm the replacement. 
If she calls me on it, I'll kill her. If she buys it, I'll kill her. Okay. <laughs> Hope you don't mind him. Parishers off. I don't just waltz about them. Hey, I tried to convince him to take a vacation. He wasn't here here. Some people's work ethic is just too strong. I'm gonna wait for her to return. Tell you what. You find out where she is, you let me know. Yeah? As a professional curse. Sure thing, Killmonger. And whoever... I'll see what I can do. Yeah. What's on the Knock yourself out. Okay. Well, this guy's dumb. Hey, guess what? Damn, somebody killed the receptionist. Wait, that's not the receptionist. It's just a filthy murderer. And they don't even care. Hey, buddy. Well, well obviously, obviously not, not from around here. <laughs> If you, if you were, were around here, you'd be Alonzo Vegas. I'm currently I'm operating, operating a sightseeing tour. Glad, Glad you asked. asked. We've placed some, some beacons, beacons across, across a series of locations, of locations around that slope. Outstanding. Outstanding! When you find, find a beacon, find, find every, every beacon. beacon. Commemorative hat. Okay. So did I even, like, lose any... In did I lose any... Reputation for that. Groundbreaker, best employee ever, deserves a big bonus and a promotion. Nice. The employee's behavior is erratic. It's recommended they see a company counselor. I love it. Okay. Oh, well, that's not a door. That's a wall. Ha ha. Oh, can't get in there. I'm honestly a little disappointed that that guy didn't care that I just straight up murked the replacement receptionist. Woods documents. So she was actually, like, hooking up with her receptionist, and that's why the receptionist wouldn't quit his job. Okay. That's cool. These are actually maps of areas in the game. That's, that's Edgewater. That's totally Edgewater. I think. Maybe not. I'm thinking that's that's the landing pad and that's Edgewater. Yeah. Yeah, that's the little river with the bridge, the graveyard. That's cool. I like that. Hmm. She's just in here playing D and D all day. Okay. Making maps. Like the sink. What's that? I don't know what that weird lighting effect is on it though. It makes me uncomfortable. Let's 
take a sippy. Boom. Some tea. Boom. And speaking of sippies, I'm going to run downstairs and get a refill. And then I will be right back. So for anybody out there who's still conscious, get ready for the empty chair stream hype. Because here it comes. Oh, actually, empty chair stream hype. But while I'm gone, I'm going to put up the hallow stream stuff. So anybody lurking knows what we're up to. Boom. You will notice that I changed the follows. Oh, it's not on here, but I've changed the follows from plus... Or no, not the follows. The 300 prism stones. I changed it from plus two minutes to plus five minutes the night of the stream. So... Well, I don't know where he went, but Hobbs was being harassed by one of the other cats. So, anyway. Dennis tries to start crap with him constantly. This morning, he jumped on him and was kicking the crap out of him, and Calrea had to drag him apart. And obviously, Dennis learned his lesson because he was like three inches away from Hobbs and growling at him and Hobbs is sitting there with his face up against the wall doing this trying to ignore him but you know Dennis is the victim when Hobbs finally breaks bad on his fluffy ass <sighs> gets what he deserves in my opinion <clears throat> maintenance tunnels I'm on my legally locked brain Really, really, I'm supposed, I'm supposed to, be to be here. Well, now I'm gonna talk oh, to you. Um, um, what are you doing here? Nothing. 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 Why? Why? Uh, does it? Does it? Does it look, look like I'm up to something? something? Yes. Lo lo I work I in the work lab with the Ministry of Accuracy, accuracy and, and Morale. morale. Maybe, Maybe I let them out more, more often, often than the regulations allow, allow, but they but need they to stretch their little legs. legs. Okay. And so what if I occasionally forgot to let them out? They escaped. And, and even, even if I did, if I dare, did dare go down, down, down there, there, they're among, they're among all, all the commons. Common. Really? really? In that, In case, that case, take this take they, have they have intelligent, intelligent eyes, eyes, an agreeable yet reserved, reserved demeanor, demeanor, and a fondness, and a fondness for hiding. For hiding. Also, also they're, they're, please, please, do take do care, care, and do mind the exterminator. Okay. Therefore, Therefore ma ma oh, very, very well. well. See, See, I'm an enormous fan of all my colonists. <laughs> well, well, I name I all name my sprats, sprats after my favorite character. character. So, you, so see, you see, I see. Not just, just name. There's, There's Lord, Lord Reginald Kim, Kim the Third, Third. Lady, Lady Philippa Philip Farnsworth, Farnsworth Vonda von Vermington, Harun Greenlee, Iskander Emmanuel Sanchez, and Evelyn Ensley Accordion. Ah, 
she's the chief executive of Farnsworth Incorporated and a fearless captain of industry. He's a mercurial shareholder. Mm. They're in a rather tumultuous marriage contract. Mm. What's Vonda's story? She's an ambitious shareholder in Farnsworth Incorporated who wants more than stock. Or does she? It's difficult, it's difficult to tell, to tell what exactly, exactly she's after, after but, but she is trying, trying to, seduce to seduce both Lord, Lord Reginald, Reginald and, and Lady Philippa. Nice. So is, so everyone. is everyone. Her room is a mysterious young man, man with amnesia. amnesia. His backstory is still a work in progress. Is Scander is Lady Philippa's trusty assistant. He's trying to seduce Vonda. Okay. She's a member of Farnsworth Incorporated's regulatory board. A wise woman with a sharp tongue and a heart of gold. Okay. Something. Something. I still, I still am. am. After, After all, all, I'm a person of very little influence. influence. But, I but I must say. say. All right. Well, later. Oh, I'll take that. Oh, I don't want that. Out of it, you wretched contraption! Does nothing in this city work anymore? Hey, man, you need to stop talking bad about Byzantium. This is the shining city on the hill, okay? This is what Rome aspired to be. Ruth Bellamy is the Halcyon Helen. Hey, Halcyon Helen. Oh, got him. That's one. So it's literally just going to be like a little sprat hunt. Okay. Um, they like to hide, do they? Well, I like to seek and destroy. So we'll see if they can escape my cunning gaze. Whoop. Hmm. Let's see. Oh, there's one. Nope, don't you go nowhere. Ha 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 ha. Oh, well, there's the chick I'm here to kill. Get away from me. Were you fooling me? Back off, all right? All right. I've, got I've got a side plan and I'm not afraid, afraid to use it. OK. I didn't know what I was doing. All right. All right. I didn't even do anything. anything. All, all I did, I did was look at the map. Hmm. What kind of maps? I was just doing my job. I wasn't trying to sabotage or undermine the board in any way. I was asked to prepare some survey maps of Emerald Vale, all right? Except I was specifically told to omit the town of Edgewater. Just make a discipline. Okay. I don't know. Okay. I swear, I don't know. Were they just going to pretend like the town never existed and that way they could just not worry about helping the people there? You're not. I'm not going to cause any trouble with <clears throat> Huh. This is a trick. <laughs> oh, okay, that's all I needed. Okay. <laughs> the the triumphant music and instant level up tells me I did the right thing there. Nope, come back. Oh wait, you're not a, you're not a friendly spread. I have to clip that later. It's pretty funny. I'm in pain. This must be what pain is. Um. Oh, shit! Oh, they surrounded me! I died like a chump! No! I had so much progress since the last time I saved! Oh, no! I've gone through so many quests! Oh... Oh, wait, no, I didn't. Okay, they, they ought to save me. Thank you! Yay! Anyway, I hear somebody at the door. It's either a ghost or a cat.
Julius? What are you doing? Do you know where Hobbs is? Oh. Anyway, <clears throat> double empty chair, chair stream, y'all. Sorry about that. Sleepy sprat. Oh. Surprise! Oh, nope. Come here. Got him. Okay. Get away! Will you? All right, what kind of map? Sub of a va. Why? I'm not gonna kill you. Good luck with that. There we go. Level up. Okay. Like I never died at all, y'all. question is why are the sprat exterminating robots specifically targeting a non-sprat like myself seems a bit strange also seems like I might be under leveled for this area having skipped an entire planet and everything Supernova Warrior. Uh. Supernova Warrior. Unstoppable. Mm -hmm. Oof. Well, I found two of them. Jokes on you, exterminators. I'm no sprat. I'm a man. And therefore immune to your powers. Um, parcels, parcels, parcels. Well, ionized paper knife. Okay. <laughs> okay. Tinkering cost for science weapons is capped. I'm gonna tinker the shit out of this stuff. Oh, two more levels. Two more levels, and we are going full prismatic hammer, y'all. And we are gonna wreck house all day long. Oh, let me see. Ionized paper knife. Hmm. 
a well-balanced energy blade. Interesting. I hear a sprat. I don't know where it is, but I hear it. Ha! I was like, I know I hear one in here. The demolished woman. Yep, I demolished her, all right. Their corpses are still of scientific interest. That's terrible. We gotta save them. We gotta save all the sprats. Oh. Got it. Mm, what's in here? This is barred. Okay. So we got one more left. I think we killed all the uh, exterminators. Oh, no, we didn't. Disagree! How are they ready? Oh god, the robots are psychic. There we go. <laughs> I thought I was being clever running running around like that, but no. I was not. I was being dumb. Hmm. You know, for a shiny beacon of capitalism, there's an awful lot of rats here. Pretty accurate representation. Okay. Oh. Where you going, buddy? century. Oh, well, I can't pick that lock. Unless I've got... Ooh, hang on. Nope. Damn. Oh, no. Kobalos! No! Kobalos, no! Oh, God! Exhibits unusually bold behaviors. Boop, get out of here. Swiggity swooty, I'm after that booty! Where are you? You giant. Ow! Good thing that Sprat was psychic and could see me coming from around the corner. Alright, we did it. Swiggity swooty, y'all. Alrighty. Well, that was horrible. My sprat whacking stick did not disappoint. Oh, he's so cute! He's the littlest of all! I wonder if there's like a way to lure them so that the sprat exterminators all freak out and attack that thing. And then you don't have to fight it. Probably not. I feel like they'd all just go after you. Because that's how the game is. Mm, 
Okay. Well, <clears throat> that's two quests down. Nice. Hi, Momo. How you doing, honey? <clears throat> Taste the freedom. Um, oh, I get another perk. Okay. Well, I need um one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. I need one more perk before I can get the wild science perk. So that That'll actually work perfectly. So what will happen is I'll basically spend the next two levels increasing my science ability. And then the next the set, the next perk I get, I'll fully unleash my skills as a science boy. So... <clears throat> Quiet weapon damage. Hmm. Yeah, we'll do that one. All righty. Oh, hey, buddy. Any luck? Any luck? Truly? Truly? And, and all, all safe and sound. sound. Please. Please. Now. now. I've got to, I've get, got to back. get back. Okay. Oh. It's a nice bin. <laughs> All right, Divide. Absolutely, my friend. Thank you for being here. I hope to see you again soon. Hope to talk to you again soon as well. So, um, take it easy. I, I'm going to finish it. I want to finish it. I really like this game. There's just so many other good games. We got Dread. Um, next month, you know, we've got Pokemon Diamond and Pearl remake. And then the month after that, we got Monster Rancher. So I, I need to get this done so I can focus on all this other amazing stuff that's coming out. Absolutely, man. You take it easy. It's great having you here. There we go. Here we go. I was like, is there any reason why they're all just sort of chilling there in the entrance? It's a little upsetting. Disconcerting. Why is there so many people here? Yeah, whatever. I have an elevator pass. Beatrice. Get bent. Wonderful. Wonderful. All filed out. So it's so done. done. Lockwood, Lockwood is, is dead. dead. Mm. Bradshaw, Bradshaw was a bit. You followed, you followed my, instructions my instructions to the letter. You've, You've demonstrated, demonstrated your talent. talent. I appreciate that you want to drive a bargain. You understand, you understand I'm not I'm paying you for anything, anything less than reliable information. information. Mm-hmm. Well, <clears> we'll <throat> have to be in touch with you somehow. Find us in Good. Good. First, First we'll, we'll file, file the appropriate paperwork. As, As instructed, instructed, the code, the code for, for our secure, secure communication... 
Oh, just a receipt for your services and a receipt for your receipt, and also a standard declaration of intent to perform espionage. I'm flattered beyond description. <laughs> okay. You're a doll, Percy. I'm flattered beyond description. Shut up. One day soon, my machine gun will feed on your soul, sir. Just be aware. It's gonna happen. Um, have I capped the... I think I just capped the tinker cost, didn't I? Oh, that's just for science weapons. <laughs> So I need another 20 points, and then I can just pretty much tinker to my heart's content. Hmm. Oh, is this me? Where was the fancy way I came in before? Where's my fancy door, damn it? Hmm. Whatever. There we go. Fancy door. It's the fanciest. Okay. Compass on the chain. Um, breakdown. Okay. Modify. We don't need to do that. <sighs> okay. Okay. Save game. Game like four levels today. We're doing good. Phineas's lab. Let's do it. No, Phineas. Uh, Phineas, is top secret Phineas. Phineas. I need to send an email. Is it okay? Just one quick email. Never touch this. No. What if I like if I like tell him that I've betrayed him, can I reverse the the plot, so to speak? I like it. 
I like it, Phineas. Phineas is not mad at all. He's like, yeah, whatever. Let's do it. Okay. Hey, free level up, baby. Yeah, we're just, we're, we're quadruple agents at this point. We're betraying everybody. First time Phineas tries to shake my hand, I might just shoot him in the face on principle. Just, just get it out of the way. This is amazing. We are rolling. <laughs> I did it. Never mind. There's nothing else to say, man. I did the thing. It happened. That crazy Phineas must have put some kind of a scrambler on his on his emails. It's not my fault. You guys should get over here as quickly as you can. Yeah. You all getting melted. <clears throat> Maybe he'll just freeze you all for 10 years and then unfreeze you and watch what happens. It's horrible. It's so terrible. Oh my god. Seth sent you a message from Andrew. I mean, we're great. Yeah, yeah. 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 Unfortunately, Unfortunately, Dr. Dr. Wells found a way to interrupt the signal before we could pinpoint his location. Come visit me in the Zandia. Okay, I'll be there. Let's do it. Ellie, I don't care about you. Felix, I don't care about you. Felix. Ranged weapons. There we go. Parvati. Just going to do the 114 for everybody, maybe. 1 1. Bonus damage with science weapons, eh? I like it. I like it. Makes it even more busted. Speak to Sophia. Well, let's go speak to Sophia, I suppose. Well, the computer's not gone supernova yet. So, boom. Boom. Let's go do some sippies and some munchies from the fridge so as not to waste our supplies. Mmm. Okay. Gotta climb down this one so I don't break my ankles again like I did be before. Let's see. No time to talk, Ellie. I'm betraying people. Here we go. The Bijou Review. Hmm. I think this might be my last little quest I'm gonna do. It's been very quiet. And I'm kind of tanking my views per hour if I'm being honest. If I'm being an honest streamer, I mean... Mag 2 Melt. Nice. Speedy mate. Well... 
Okay. I just spent all my money basically buying the upgrades that I just put on my current machine gun. Just to have them for the next gun. <laughs> Oof. It's Rizzo's. It's a good... Oh, no, don't, don't do that. No, come back up. It's a good combination. The Speedy Mate Barrel, plus 15% rate of fire and corrosive damage, post-armor damage. To, oh, it's so beautiful. I love it all. My bullets shoot faster, ignore armor, and do more damer, damage after the armor has been counted. It's just better in every way. I'm curious. Well, well, well. Simple, he was trying to use me. Revenge is a powerful Wells was the awesome manipulative. Turning him in is the right thing. You've done well. You're efficient, talented. I'm listening. There has been a surge of off world broadcasting coming from my army. Much of it is propaganda. All of it is illegal. We need those broadcasts shut down. Since when did the board have a problem with propaganda? I'm suggesting the board spreads propaganda. Our messages are rooted in truth. The broadcasts coming from Monarch pollute the ape lies. Oh, okay. All of Monarch's extraplanetary broadcasts are routed through Devil's Peak Station. I want you to keep Monarch as a dead and anti and barber. I have an agent working in Stellar Bay. Every deal. The Kinda Pine Grows at Night. Isn't that the new of a romance serial? Yes. yes. So, what? so what? Look, that's Look, not that's important. important. Get it? Monarch, Monarch is a hotbed of anarchists anarchist operating under the misguided notion that the colony, that colony doesn't need, need the guiding hand of the, the board. Oh, okay. It may not be a single individual behind these broadcasts, but any number of factions. I'll take care of it. Percival before you go. Percival! Percival! Oh. Oh, there he is. Adjutant Akande has instructed me to reward you for... Another 24,000 XP. They're giving an XP out like it's candy on Halloween. Plus 64,000! Okay, I don't... Okay. Quite I've authorized your ship with an official board certified I've navigator. heard like uh, 100,000 XP in the last five minutes. As an acting agent of the board, you are entitled to purchase a selection of the do let let. If you're traveling to Mon Mon, I am contractually obligated to inform you that it is an honor. Also, I, I, ooh, the pauper popper. Wow. <laughs> Interesting. Latinus, if it was good enough for Caesar, that's a really nice spear. I like these weapons. I don't want to like these weapons, but I like these weapons. Assault rifle ultra. Ultra! I like my gun now, though. Let's see. Okay. Let's a moon man helmet. Okay. Magnum, Mag two zap, speed grip, Mr. Pro. Hmm. Hmm. That was easy. <laughs> Ooh. 
We did it. <laughs> Hell yeah. Alright, well we got our we got our nav nav beacon to Stellar Bay. And oh look at that. We can now tinker the uh, science weapons up to our heart's content. So let's have some fun with that hammer, shall we? Let's see. There it do. Now let's see how badly we can break this gun. Tinker. Caps at 200. Mm, I like it. Okay. 236 damage. Special effect is knocked down. And it alternates between damage types. 209. Just, just a few more bits. Okay, well, put that away. Bust that bad boy out. Nice. Very nice. Um, transfer. I'm gonna store this. I like this. This is a my my smack and stick. I like my smack and stick. It's a good it's a good weapon. I mean, I'm completely broke now. But let's go to Cascadia. Let's see how we can do in Cascadia. Fun, fun, fun. Let's drink this. Bop. There we go. Save game. Okay. Well, we got the tinkering cost down to like nothing. So there's that. We've gained a ton of levels. So. The next little bit of money that we're working to earn is going to just go towards upgrading our stuff because we've gained a lot of levels really quickly. And I can level up all of these weapons quite a bit now. So, yeah. About that. Sell. Okay. Simply the best TNO. I wouldn't mind having one of those ultra assault rifles just because I've got like 4,000 rounds of ammunition for that weapon. Um, but I'm happy with this for now. Do need to come over here get my special helmet. I think it was in here. Purpleberry police helmet. Yep, there we go. There we go. There we go. There we go. Hey, buddy. And... Bow, 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 bow. There we go. That was scary. <laughs> Woo! Okay, there we go. And there we go. And good stuff. Hey, Julius. If you come over here messing with me, you're going to be on TV. Don't do it. Uh oh. He's doing it, y'all. You coming up? If you come up here, I'm going to put you on camera. He's thinking about it. He says, Do I want to be famous? What are you doing? He says, no, not today. Thank you. 
You didn't know I like shooting games? Yeah, I like shooting games, Zachy. I'm just not real into Fortnite. I play a fair amount of shooting games. In fact, I've done I've done a lot of Fallout 4. I've done a lot of this. The first game that I ever streamed when I first got started was actually uh, Serious Sam, The First Encounter. So I think there's a cat behind me wiping out on the windowsill. <laughs> I can't help you because if I do, you won't learn anything, Julius. <laughs> also, hello, Zachy boy. How are you doing? <clears throat> And, actually, when I first got started, I had a, a fairly popular um, set of streams that I was doing. Um, back in the day, as the games were coming out, I actually did a solo legendary completions on all the Halo games um, up through Halo 4. And that was actually a really popular series that I was doing, but it kind of turned into a rage game for me because the thing with the Halos was like, there was a couple of years between each one to cool off and playing them back to back legendary solo one after the other every Friday. It, it got pretty bad. Um, I am, I am actually forbidden from, from streaming halo, um, by Cal Rhea because it made me so angry, but I did solo it. I did solo reach and I did a good chunk of some of the other games before I was kicked off of it forever. So yeah, I like shooters. Yeah. Some of them are harder than others. Um, most of them, there's only like two difficult spots in every level and the rest of it's pretty much smooth sailing for me. It was actually interesting because I had a few people that I picked up a few early followers that I found out were like, they were like Halo legendary speedrunners, and they would basically just come in and watch me because in their words, it was refreshing to watch someone beat the game on Legendary without doing exploits. I was like, oh, well, I'm so glad that you enjoy watching me not know what I'm doing. <laughs> but, yeah. I don't do, um multiplayer shooters that's that's the thing is I don't I don't play multiplayer shooters because I'm a very competitive person um, actually years and years ago I'm actually I'm dating myself now but um, back in the back in the heyday of Halo 2 I was actually in an XGC clan that focused exclusively on big team battles and I was like their 11th seed so essentially I was like their 11th rated person in XGC Archangel for big team battles. Um, and that was like all we did was we just ran big team battles over and over and over on all those levels. And um, it was a lot of fun, but coming from that to like playing shooter, like multiplayer shooters with random people or people that don't dedicate that amount of time to it, and I don't dedicate that amount of time to it anymore, it just becomes very frustrating because I'm like, I know that we could do better, and I know I can do better, and it just upsets me. So, I just don't do it. <laughs> Let's see. Switch to that. Nope. No, don't don't hit me again, please. I need to jump. Are you zoned? Yeah, he's zoning out. He's gonna heal back up. Okay. I think I killed his little buddy though. I 
Maybe I didn't kill his little buddy. Achievement, Elemental Maelstrom. I did I did every type of damage to a single enemy. <laughs> Very nice. Hmm. That's amazing. That that achievement is so hard to get unless you use that hammer and just swing wildly. Ooh, assault rifle ultra. So are you going to be streaming uh, later on, Zachy? Are you streaming now? I know you guys are on vacation, if I'm not mistaken. Or at least I know Blair is. I'm assuming you're both on vacation. It's 10.30 at night for me, so... more than I realized. Oh, shit. Get out of here. Wasn't so bad, was it, guys? No, no, it wasn't so bad. It's not so bad. Anything good over here? Just a couple of dead bodies. Well, the bodies have loot on them, so there's that. Plasma cutter gold. Or not Blair, Zaki has left the building. Huh. He did a heckin' abandon. Okay. Was he killed by Sprats? Wow. One shy. or something. Get out of here. Okay. Well, that's all done. 
Corrosive weakness. I will hold B to reject your offer of a sucky weakness. Thank you. Oh, children. What are you doing? Hey. Quit it. Cats. Damn cats. Always with the cats. And she just comes running right back in. Surprise! Round two! Meow. I'm just gonna let her get her ass kicked. That'll teach her. So many Raptodon Colossi. It's not even funny. Oh, that's a Mega. Woo! No wonder it hurts so bad. Where are you at, buddy? Gonna keep decking you, brother. Yeah, get out of here. Are you ready? Can't handle this. You need another difficulty level if you're gonna try to go toe to toe with me, friend. For anyone who's wondering, we are playing on Supernova. There is no other difficulty. I'm just that good. This is where I got killed before. All these little angry mantasaurs messed me up. Run, run, run. Up the hill we go. Switch to Mantasaurs now, which means we're making good progress. Cascadia, Fallbrook, Amber Heights.
faked me out. There we go. I am wearing down my gun pretty quickly, I will say. There was a workbench back in that last little area before I went up the hill, I think. But I didn't want to risk running up against a Manta Queen, so you see how well I thought that out. Terra 1 Publications discovered. Oh, we're actually not too far from the town. Nice. Not too far from the town at all. Might even be able to avoid most of the combat at this point. Let's see. Well, that's a no-go. <laughs> that's not going to work. He's just like, nah, I'm done. Dunzo! That's that cower ability. Pretty sure this is the area with all the cannibals in it as well. Well, not all the cannibals. There's a family of cannibals that lives in this little area. But we'll get to that quest soon enough. to heal. Um, see, the problem is that my gun is breaking because I've been using it to kill literally dozens of these things. Ow! And you're dead. Good trade, buddy. Any more? Okay. Okay. That's that amazing dodging. <sighs> Only like a level 30 dodge and it does so much. Run! Didn't even need the key. <laughs> oh, God. Mm. 
<clears throat> so before I do anything in this place, I want to find the landing pad and then just transfer my ship here. And um, I'm probably going to call it a night, to be completely honest. There we go. Hey, bud. Don't think Don't I've think seen, you seen you around. around. That, means that means you must you be new to Stella Bay. Bay. You seem surprised. You must you have must seen those UDL gunships on your way in. There's always, There's always... You may not, you may have, not have heard, heard you being new, but Stella, Stella... Which means I... I I'll be half happy. Well, well. well they're, they're, I'm, I'm not, not supposed, supposed to do that. It's against... Oh, oh, that'll, that'll just, just make Mr. Sondar's. But that's, that's all. <laughs> we don't get we don't ship get traffic, traffic in town. town. Only off who do make, make, make it out. And thank, thank the stars for them. them. Oh, oh sure. sure. They make, they Stellar, make Stellar Bay, Bay sound, sound like a rotten, rotten place, place, but it's not so bad. bad. Get a good breeze going, and sulfur smell mostly covers up the fishy smell. Anyway, Mr. Sondar. Mr. Sondar. Oh, oh. I got, I got only I have Sure I can do that. Gotta sign you in. Have you had time to check on that? Yeah, bro. Two seconds ago we spoke. Calm down. Okay. So 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 keep that so so Oh, wait, no, I want to buy that back. That was an upgraded one. I finally got an upgraded one. Yes! Oh, my God, yes. I've been waiting for that. Hell, yeah. I have been waiting for an upgraded mining helmet ever since I got the first one. Yes. Oh, it's beautiful. Beautiful. Boom, instant armor upgrade. And I can tinker that up even more. And I've capped the cost for tinker, or no, I've, I've reduced the cost for tinkering by 90%. I haven't capped the cost for tinkering that, unfortunately. But we're going to drink our last Gigantar energy drink. And there we go. And there's our ship. Boom, boom, boom. The damage of science weapons increases as science skill improves. Nice. So I'll just keep on leveling up science. I guess. Okay. Tinker armor. Oh, it's beautiful. Oh, such good gains. Yes, thank you. 47 armor. That's a good, that's almost a ton of armor. Okay. Store that. And journal. <gasps> Murder on Eridanos. Oh, that's the DLC. I haven't done that yet. That's cool. So it just pops up like that. It doesn't even really tell you. It just, it's there. All right. Well, there we go. Well, 
I don't know if Zachy's planning to stream or if he's streaming now or what, because I think he has left us. But that's all the time we have for tonight, give or take a few minutes. So um, it was very quiet, but I enjoyed being able to chat with Yelith and Divide. Uh, just hang out and make some progress in this game that I've been told I'll never beat. So thank you all, as always, for watching. Any of you lurkers out there, I appreciate you. Uh, be sure to give a follow, you know, dare I say, a subscribe, and tune in next time. Um, <clears throat> our next scheduled stream is going to be on Tuesday, 8 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. We'll be back with more Breath of Fire 3, which I'm very much looking forward to. Great game, great people, great fans um, that come in and watch me play it. So it should be a lot of fun. But for now, I'm going to give my voice a rest. I'm going to give my eyes a rest, and if I don't see you all next time, then hey, stay healthy and stay safe out there, y'all. Later.